Yeah, welcome. You know, MCFBA game day number one. We're just supposed to be at Texas Tech. Good thing we didn't have it there. Absolute blowout. So today we're here in Michigan, big house. You know, UNC. Curly Michigan. Green. Curly, twenty touchdowns. Face twenty touchdowns. Going to be a shootout, you know. And Curly first, first, I'm gonna hand over to Dillister. He's gonna talk about the games that already happened today this week. You know. Yeah, uh, we had three games already this week, and there was not a single close game. Uh, what, was the, what was the first game? It was like West Virginia against Yoshi State. Yeah, West Virginia and Yoshi State. First broadcast game. Everyone, oh, very hyped. No, it was 38 to 2. Uh, and there was, we can talk about it. I think you guys are sleeping on West Virginia. Uh, they didn't have their key players of Goldfish they or did not Andrew. have the former Heisman. They did not have the not, former Heisman. But Yoshi State also didn't have Pure Canada, another. Superstar. Right, did not. Well, she brought a little shiver to me, in my opinion. You know. Um, other than that, they were very good. It was a really boring game. They're like basement dwellers trying to beat each other. All right, next game. Next game. You next game was um, Tennessee Ole Miss, which I have something to say. No, it was Ole Miss and uh, yeah, Tennessee. Yeah, you're right. You're right. Tennessee forty four. We don't care. They join B coach. Doesn't matter. Ole Miss six. I want to say something. Cause impressed me. I'm actually going to say it. Cause looked good. I'm going to say Poggy Doggy himself looked good. You can, like, cue the highlights right now. Cause cook in Tennessee. Okay. He's going to lead this team to victory. Any, any thoughts there currently on Tennessee? Uh, all I got to say is uh, Rocky Top, baby. All right. All right. We have I agree. A, 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 a. Rocky Top. You will always be sweet all home to me. And uh, next game. Rocky Top. Rocky Top. Texas Tech versus the Ohio State game. Number two Texas Tech, keep that in mind, versus Ohio State. I was watching a very good movie called Wakanda Forever. But um, Ohio State Ohio State played fantastic what I heard. But I also heard they played with three players, which is a little bit interesting. Heard they cheated. There's a little investigation going into that. And if you're watching this Ohio State, we're coming for you. Just want to make oh that God, clear. Oh we're about, Texas yo, Tech we're, will we're back. This your whole franchise. Hashtag. Yo. And let's oh. talk about the, the, the big game. Let's talk. Let's talk. You know, we got Michigan number three and then number one UNC. The big yeah, news story. Game, honestly. <laughs> Keep it Two to there. three final <laughs> score, Michigan. <laughs> For being honest, the biggest news story is Luke, who is not playing. You know, that is a huge blow to UNC, but we have Curly, and we have Curly, and we have Curly, and um, he's going to play great for the team. Um, Damn straight. But Michigan, they're pretty good. They got FaZe. You know, he's pretty good. Former quarterback of the national championship so winning right, season two Holy Cross Crusaders. Two time, two time, two time. Two time. And Curly's announced a start, which he, if I don't remember, he never really had a lot of starts at QB, but he went in a lot. Blow our team back. I trust him. He knows what he's doing. But Curly, Curly's getting locked in. No, no one's beating him. Um, I will shove my fist here? so far up your ass, phase. All right, should we preview? Should we preview next week, Dustin? I'm going to read some games. I need some previews real quick. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, I'll, I'll read them. No, I can read them. I can read them. All right, first, we got Texas, number two, Texas Tech right now. New polls, I'm not Jerome. This is number six, oh. Yoshi State. All right, what do you think about that game? Uh, I, I have uh, Texas Tech bouncing back that week. If yeah, they you, decide Tony, what do you to think about back, that? Let, get this. I know you weren't there, but facts looks terrible today. Ooh, interesting. Hey, Carly, yeah. any, any thoughts on Yoshi State or Texas Tech? Listen. Everyone knows I'm a big fan of Yoshi State. And I'm going to tell you now, I'm sorry, Kiwi. I know you're our cameraman right now, but Yoshi State's going to run. Oh, oh, I forgot their coach. Their coach tried to kill himself. But jumped into the <laughs> oncoming traffic. Rest in peace. And now he's our cameraman. But this game. Good luck. He has okay, a lot. Game, there has been some information about this. So next game is actually... um. Oh, what's it called? West Virginia, which they have quarterbacking issues. Free annex. So it's probably Michigan, Ohio State. I think Ohio State's going to win by 40 if they don't cheat and play with two players. But 
But, but starting, starting, very interesting, starting for West Virginia, I did report this earlier, according to corner from ESPN, but this was originally sourced from Bleacher Report, the best media station. Mr. Zotik with a K will start for West Virginia, which is very interesting, considering Annex probably will be there. I would start Annex at QB. Haas, please save Annex. God Anyways. damn, he's bad. Sorry. They, West Virginia, terrible quarterback play. You can put in a clip of an interception right there by them, you know. They're pretty oh – God, please just don't even give me words to describe the atrocity of a QB play. Think about Nathan Peterman mixed with Bo Nix when he plays an SEC team, and that's what you get for quarterback play. Oh, Bo Nix is having an incredible season, folks. Facts. Can we talk about that for the Oregon Ducks? He's having a great year, minus that one game. And how about them damn Horn Frogs? And let's talk about next game on the slate. Oh, boy, this is a great game. Big rivalry. Very close to my heart. On Fox, 11-20 at 8-30. The currently number four Tennessee Volunteers take on it. The number one, apparently, UNC Tornadoes at home. Kodak versus Joey B, the father versus the son. Tennessee but wins that game. The low boy versus the massive giant. The um the Pluto compared to Jupiter. The Patriots versus the Jets. Tennessee the upset. Alabama versus Tennessee East Washington upset. State. The uh Appalachian State versus Michigan. The I'm trying to think right, Georgia versus Oregon. All right, we get it. We get it. If we're looking at the talent wise, it's not that far apart. But Luke is playing, and Luke and Curly might combine for 44 yards that game. Uh, well, I'm about to send on something. Uh, oh, hey, hey okay. Curly. People are pro- people have been waiting to see what Curly is going to predict for that game, but you'll see whenever the headgear pops up. Of who's you'll see when. Me and Curly are repping orange instead of light blue. Interesting. Okay. <laughs> Anyways, speak about it. The coaching matchup is completely unmatched. I could throw Dank in there. Multiple <laughs> shots in, blindfolded with max, max brightness on his TV at max volume. Not in the other team's voice chat, and I still think he could coach better than Joey B. His play calling is horrible. Everything is horrible. He's like, who's a bad coach? Yeah, he's like Doc Rivers when he needs to quit something. He's bad. Oh, wow. Right, bro. Should, we, should okay. we, like, move on and do the helmet selection? Like, no, we, we, between Tennessee and uh, UNC. No, that's hot not take, Hot take, take hot we take. If Kiwi plays, he wins Heisman. The ones on the ground, I can't do this. Luckily, this is cut out, so we don't have to hear phase one. One more game in week two. I don't even think we should preview it, but it's Michigan at Ole Miss. Cause... Okay, this is why we don't preview it. Cause breakout game, 400 yards in the – not in the big house, at the cause fraudulent place. But Michigan's still going to run. Cause – all right, let me give you a quick call. Cause drops back throws in here, touchdown, the lead is cut to 47. All right, so Michigan's going to be in my 50. Uh, and- I'm just going to go ahead and say cause may have a good game, but that good game is going to be reflected in Michigan's stat sheet. Whenever he throws six interceptions. All right. Anyways, shall we continue with our UNC versus Michigan mascot? I think that's what's going on right now. Damn straight, we should. All right. Let's see what we got here. Um, we are currently in the big house, mm. home of Faze himself and the Michigan Wolverines, the best wide receiver in the league. The best wide receiver core in the entire league. Bro thinks he's coach. (laughs) So, the right choice would obviously be to put on this hat. Which one? I say, fuck it, because Curly doesn't make ordinary picks. Go with the Tar Heels! Million, baby! Fuck off! Oh, he's gone.